most hideous creature ever. Did you ever wonder who invented the names of animals? Like just, hey look over there, we're gonna call it a... Uh, now here are some strange animal names that I'm like, what? The first one is the panda. This is how I think the story goes about naming a panda. A panda, because you got two pandas. You got the red panda and a, yeah, the normal panda. Let's go all into the panda dream. Welcome everybody. Today, I've brought you here for a special trip. Because you know, we found a word that needs to be placed on an animal. Yes indeed. You are probably wondering why the hell is he wearing this beautiful coat? No, that's not why we're here. We are here to find an animal for a panda. And you two are going to get it. Panda. <laughs> what a funny name. Don't you think? <laughs> what? Panera. There's not even an A between what? the N and the D. You're just making it up. Can't I put an A between it? Oh, just, just please, no, you can't put an A between there. That's not how it works. Come on, stop, man. Oh, oh, so now it's my problem? I don't need to... No, no, it's you started. Oh, no, you started. No, you started. No, you. Can you two please be quiet? I'm trying to explain what a panda is, okay? Just please be quiet. Okay, so right. sorry. But he started. So this guy was walking <laughs> through the bamboo fields and he just only saw green, 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 green. And I was like, is it so hard to find a panda? Is it so hard? Until one thing, a black, white thing moved. I was like, what is that over there? So we walked over there and found a panda. So this guy was traveling to the other side of China. He was like, where can I find a panda? It's so hard to find a panda. So he was resting on a tree. Then at a certain point, he looked at the right. I was like, hey, that's a creature over there. Should I go after it? And then the second animal is the blobfish. I mean like, have you seen it? Why did God even make it? I mean like, when you look at it, it's a giant piece of jelly. But if you put it out of the water, it's like the most hideous creature ever. Then another animal is, this is the strangest name I've ever saw. It's a mountain chicken. It's not even a chicken, look. Oh, oh that's a strange uh, animal. I've never saw it. Let's call it a chicken. Chicken were there from the beginning of the dinosaurs, I think. I'm not sure. Imagine someone who, fo who found this. Someone who was hiking through the mountains. I was like, oh yeah, I am going to discover a new creature. I was like, oh, did you saw it? That must be the chicken where everyone is talking about. I knew it. I found a mountain chicken. Just please, there, just, just there's the door. Just don't even come in again. I mean like, you're not even welcome in this world. The next one is the eye eye. This creature is so strange. I don't know why they name it like this. How I imagine it is, is that someone was just walking through the forest like every scientist is walking through a forest and then something attacked him from behind and I was like, I, I, that's the only explanation that I can find. If you even think about the name, it's like a Dracula figure. The I, I is coming tonight to get you, man. When I think of an I, I, I think of a three finger man with the middle finger longer than the rest and it's like oh no that's E.T. no no wait is it behind me? oh my god and then the fifth one the normal spear on his head who can make satay sticks for the barbecue unicorn swimming thing I mean like who doesn't want to be like have you seen their horn there is I think one third of the body or something it's so huge I don't think if you're like hey Poor, 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 poor. You're gonna hurt someone, <laughs> and I don't think your girlfriend is gonna like it when you are cuddling and you are like, <laughs> she's dead. <gasps> Why did you put it in this video, Fox? That's a great answer. Now I put it in the video because if you try to manipulate the name, it's near wall. I don't think a narwhal. 
can go, can go very close to a wall. Do you get it? Near wall. I know what Venter thought. He was on a ship looking through his telescope. I was like, probably a Polish people. No, no, I'm not sure. <laughs> Yeah, it was probably not from England, and I was like, Oh, look over there! A wall! He meant whale. Oh, a wall! And I was like, Where? 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 I can't jump. Where is it? No, there! Next to the wall! <laughs> no, it's not funny. Up to the next one. Now, and then the last. The one I fear the most! The shoe bill! Are you kidding me? A bird! Yes! A bird! They, they are so scary! Just look at it! I think I know why they call him a shoe bill. It's like two shoes! I mean like he could roar! <laughs> Go to his shoe shop and be like, hey, I need a new pair of shoes. What can you give me? Oh no! Not a shoe bill! Or, but why the bill? Is it because he has sexy hips? Oh yeah! If you agree with me, punch the like button. And yes, um, you can always subscribe to me. And yes, I'll see you guys in the next video. The box is out!